Hello and welcome to another video. On this video I will show you how you can program the EGR if you have replaced this component or you just take it out for cleaning. When you unplug the cable you should program back to the car, okay? Reset the adaptation. And for that we will use Lexia. This is a video because the subscriber request me in the private on the email to show him if it's possible how you can program EGR or components on the Citroen with Lexia and because I do have chance to work now in this Citroen C5 where I've been doing a few videos about reading and writing I will show you also how you can program these components or reset the components okay before jump to this programming to answer also to another question how you can change the language on this virtual machine you can use also with the program but today I'll use this virtual machine you notice here on the corner you have the menu you just press there you go to configuration and you have change user language and the next one is also modification the language okay you should change both not only one place also the user language and also over here the program okay let's, now let's go back to our business this is a c5 It is not so fast comparing with uh, native program. Through this virtual machine, it will take a while, but also if I switch on, it will be much better. On virtual machine you should have uh, the en uh, engine on before starting this. On the native program it will take also the VIN without uh, have the engine on. Okay, we should put a code. You will find it here. And I believe it's 10530. Yes, looks like that. Then 10530. I hear the relay clicking. Now we should wait. I'll be waiting for a few seconds, maybe one minute, but you can also go sleeping and when you come back will you have the same image because I didn't pay attention when I pressed it to start this one here. We go to diagnosis. Okay, we should make test first global scanning switch off you should follow also the procedure okay it's not so friendly diagnostic dyslexia you notice the scanning on this virtual box is much quicker than native software it installed in our PC because the software is, is much newer and the transfer data is much much quicker much up to date so okay this is our injection and this one also the engine It is true. The 
and you'll have information where the this is, the racing, history, this is the live data, actuation, and here when you replace the components, and you have initialized the auto adaptive, okay, you have the ECU replacement, don't go over here, and this is a particle, okay. And after reading this carefully, it's a lot of read, but you should pay attention, okay? You'll press enter and you should follow the steps. And after reading these things carefully, and with attention, okay, he will show you this okay and we will jump over here and you have have the EGR this is a double throttle and it's true you should also reset this one Okay. Let's take it one after each other. It's like, for example, this one. Let's take this one. It's an hour case. You hear it over there a noise. And now you will go back, you will switch off, and when you start the car, you leave it for 10 seconds, and you leave the motor uh, at the idling, okay? Just leave uh, one minute the engine to run like that, and this is how you can reset your components on this car. And that's it with this adaptation. You, you noticed you have also another one there. For these cars, you should have Lexia. If you don't have Lexia, I tried with uh, Launch, but Launch doesn't have. Uh, Texa, he have, but only for EGR, not for the um, replacement of um, Particle filter or for replacement of uh, uh, throttle body and uh, yeah it's only for EGR on, on Texa and for this job you should definitely use this Alexia software and I believe this video is enough if you are interested to see videos which related with Citroen and Peugeot let me to know like always thank you for watching bye bye